And the scripture comes to mind, Proverbs 10, 22. The blessing of the Lord brings wealth without sorrow. And I wanted to, I wanted to clear that up. The blessing of the Lord brings wealth. One of, actually, one of the versions says without joy, which means we're not striving for it. We're allowing the blessing. And I heard God say there's people in the room that he is actually igniting and activating a wealth creating in the Because the Bible says that God gives us the power to create wealth. It also says the wealth of the wicked is laid up for the just. We are justified in Christ. And as we align ourselves, it's been beautifully encouraged today, as we align ourselves with God's kingdom and the righteousness of God, then the wealth of the wicked is laid up for you. And there are some people here today, and I believe that God has already put on my heart, that we know that the wealth isn't just for a nice car, a nice house, a nice little spot for you. You know it's for a great good. And so I just want to be clear that over here, Mother, there's certain people in this room that God's saying now is the time. It seems completely impossible. It seems like it's a 10 year plan, but God's saying, I am your plan. And I can cause miracles of financial favour. I can cause miracles of financial provisions. I can cause miracles of wealth. I feel like there's some things that are being unlocked in people's lives to bring wealth into your life. So if you know that there's a promise of wealth, if you, if you know actually that the enemy has come to roll from you, God's saying, I'm winning the recompense. And it's time for you to align with the wealth creator that you are. Who resonates with that? Yeah. So you just stand with me. Let's just lift up our hands together. Become aware. Father, we become aware of your presence that is here in the room because you never leave us all the us. Your presence has been here. But when we become aware of even the deliberate increase, we're actually you're sealing the deal. Feel like God's saying He's sealing the purpose. And right now there's an unlocking, unblocking of that creating anointing. There is an unlocking of that understanding of walking in the blessing. The blessing of the Lord brings wealth without sorrow or toil. And Father, right now we declare that unlocking in people's lives today. We declare miracles of finances being released, released to people's lives, to people's businesses. We declare those, those contracts, those things that have been pulled up, those things that have been robbed in the name of Jesus. We command an instant breakthrough now. Because God, you, Jesus, you died for this. And so right now, even as already been spoken and prophesied and declared over these people, we declare that alignment of wealth that can only come from you, provision that can only come from you, and the things that are being held up right now being released, raining down those impossible projects, those impossible things right now, being unlocked and unblocked. Because God, you bring life and you bring it to abundance. And we disable every strategy of the enemy that's blocked and withheld. And we command your recompense according to Jeremiah, recompense to be released. When the thief is found out, he must return sevenfold. And actually, Genesis 26, when we sow in feminine, Isaac sow in feminine, to a hundredfold return, so we command the hundredfold to be released to your world's creating yours. It can only come from you in Jesus' name. Amen. Sarah, receive it. I receive, I receive it. it. The unlocking and the unlocking today, walking in the miracle of increase. Awesome. Just take a seat for a moment. So what's going to happen?